The coronavirus has caused all of our lives to change. Writing major of the University of Tampa, Rebecca Lazansky, shows her perspective. I was in Florida for school. I'm originally from Pennsylvania. It was like mid-March, we got the notice that school was going to move entirely online. Suddenly I was not allowed to go to my campus anymore. You know, I couldn't use the library or anything like that. I was living off campus, so it did not affect my living situation. I had friends who got kicked off and had to go home, but I just pretty much stayed here. I got furloughed from my job and eventually got laid off. My boyfriend got furloughed from his job and got laid off. So we were both just like in our apartment trying to do work at the same time, trying to do class at the same time. It was interesting to see how the different classes transitioned. I was speaking, teaching English to speakers of other languages. We sat in a circle in class to do that one. So that was hard to move online. We ended up just not having class meetings. I was in fiction one, and that was another one where we faced each other. So that one we did Zoom meetings where we were all in and we did workshop through Zoom. I was in a literature class, and then I was in an independent study that I had to schedule meetings with my professor. My literature class ended up being discussion board and recorded video lecture based. I live and eat and sleep by Google Calendar. If I needed to watch a lecture by 4 p.m. on a Thursday, I could look through my week and say, okay, I have time on Wednesday. You have to kind of give yourself structure or else you're just not gonna do it. It's actually helped collaboration in a way. That anxiety is out of the way, but then it is also, you do miss that person to person. Here, look at this thing that I wrote or like exchanging papers and notes. Being a senior is tough with this situation because you only have so much freedom. You have to take the classes that you have to take. It was just a period of a lot of uncertainty of, am I going to be able to finish my degree? Am I going to have a graduation? It's not how I thought my few years here were going to be. It's had its benefits in the way where I think my interpersonal relationships have improved. But overall, it's been tough. From the WBUZ, I'm Isabella Roseland.